this report from the FBI would not go to the public. This would be only going to senators. Tell us a little bit about the process there and what uh, they're expected to announce. Right, Sherry. Well, this is going to be going sometime tonight, presumably, over to the Senate. Uh, it's going to be kept uh, locked up in the Senate Judiciary Committee room, uh, and then it will be brought at 8 a.m. tomorrow. Uh, we're told the tentative plan is for the one copy to be available, and uh, first the, the chairman of the uh, Judiciary Committee, Senator Chuck Grassley, and whatever staff he wants, will be able to look at it, read it, ask questions of staff who've reviewed it, uh, and then separately, Diane Feinstein, the uh, senior Democrat on the, on the panel, will be taking a look at it and also asking questions. Uh, then there is some plan to allow a little bit wider uh, dissemination, but uh, again, very restricted access to this report, uh, only to senators and only one copy and uh, locked up in a room, uh, which doesn't suggest that uh, at least immediately that any, th any part of it is going to be released to the public. Any idea then, Joe, how this could affect the confirmation vote? Well, much depends on what the, what is in there. Uh, as you mentioned, there it was not any follow-up interviews done with uh, either uh, Dr. Ford or uh, Judge Kavanaugh. Uh, there have been other people who were named uh, or were associated with them uh, at that time who have been questioned. They've confirmed through their lawyers. Uh, at least one of the other uh, accusers has has also been. Uh, talked with. Uh, so uh, much will depend on, on what the FBI uh, has found and what people tell them. Uh, it is not clear that it's going to, uh, uh, it would have to have something new, uh, some new revelation uh, that to likely to, to change any votes. Uh, and the votes are still very much up in the air. Right. Is there a sense, Joe, of what the White House strategy is behind this? Well, right now they're 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 trying to keep it contained and push it on forward. This has been a very uh, motivating issue for uh, Republicans, for Trump supporters particularly. He's used it in his rallies. Uh, it came under criticism for a rally last night in which he seemed to be mocking Dr. Ford. Uh, and uh, so this is uh, th this fight is very much part of the White House strategy to get Republicans motivated to vote in the midterm elections coming up on November six. Democrats, uh, Democratic voters have already been quite energized based on polls, uh, and there was some concern that uh, Republicans would be sitting out, uh, sitting at home, uh, because uh, the president has told them repeatedly, "Don't believe the polls." Uh, so uh, the polls showing that Democrats have an advantage going into the election. Uh, so the White House now is 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 trying to really whip up uh, the Republicans to to get out to vote to show that this is an important issue and uh, to get them to the polls.